Hey everyone, welcome back to another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial we are going to create a simple but beautiful slideshow, like this. So let's start it. As usual, first create a new composition. 1920 by 1080, 30 frame per second, change comp name main comp. Now drag your image into timeline. Resize your image according to comp size. Then select image and pre-compose them. Make sure select move all attributes into the new composition, and change name image 1. Now drag dust image into the composition. And resize according to composition. Now duplicate dust image and rotate them. Now create a new composition change comp name shape. Then select rectangle tool and create a shape like this. It take little bit time, so I speed up this part. Perfect. Now add color as you like. Then duplicate the shape layer. And change the color white. And make both shape 3D layer. Now select first shape and press R for rotation, and add a expression on Z rotation, time into open bracket 100 close bracket. Copy this expression and paint second shape layer. So that it's look like this. Now duplicate both shape layer several times. Move and resize all shape randomly. I am skipping this part so that, you don't have to wait. After doing all positioning and resizing it's look like this. Now create a null layer and parent all shape layer with null layer. And also convert null layer into 3D layer, then press P for position, and go to first frame and move Z position close to camera, and add a keyframe. Then go to 3 second forward and reset position value. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. Go to graph editor and make your graph look like this. If your graph does not look like this right click and select edit speed graph. Now go to the main comp and drag shape comp. Then drag light leak footage into the composition. Change blending mode screen. And also change the opacity 40%. You can adjust the light leak according to your choice. Now add some text on composition. I am just typing my channel name, but you're free to choose any name. Then pre-compose the text layer, make sure select move all attributes into the new composition, and change comp name text 1. Then create a new adjustment layer, and apply fast blur. Check to repeat edge pixels, and blurriness around 9. Then create a black solid, and select ellipse tool. Double click on ellipse tool to make a perfect ellipse. Go to mask 1 and check to inverted. Expand mask 1 property. And change mask feather around 170. And opacity around 12.
Just turn off the adjustment layer for few seconds, then create a new white solid layer, and apply CC starburst effect. Change scatter 800. Speed, 0.14. And also change the blending mode screen. And opacity 40%. Now create a new adjustment layer and apply for optics compensation. Check reverse lens distortion and change field of view 150. Then go to one second forward and change value 0. So that it's look like this. Perfect. Now create a new camera, 35mm is good for me. Then create a new null layer. And convert all layer into 3D layer. Then go to first frame and move Z position of null layer close to camera. Make sure your camera parent with null layer. Then go to 3 second forward and reset the position value. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now go to our fast blur adjustment layer. Turn on them. Then double click on ellipse tool for make a perfect ellipse. Go to mask and check to inverted. Expand mask property and change feather around 200. Perfect. Now select all layer and pre-compose them. And change name scene 1. Now we are going to create a transition, so. Create a new white solid. And duplicate two time. Move to white solid layer below the scene one comp layer. Now apply fill effect on last layer, and change the color as you like. Then copy fill effect and paste its second solid layer. And change color white. And also paste into the first solid layer and change color white. Now go to the first layer and select all solid layer and press S for scale. And unlink the scale value. And change X scale value 0. Then go to 1 second forward, and change X scale value 100. Then select scene 1 layer and change the track mat, alpha mat. So, it's look like this. Now move the all three last keyframe little bit offset like this. Select all keyframes and easy ease them.
perfect. Now duplicate all layers and move them together, and offset around 2 and half second. Delete all keyframe of scene 2. Go to first frame of scene 2 and press S for scale. This time change Y value 0 of all solid layer. Go to around 1 second forward and change Y scale value 100. And offset the last keyframes. Now go to project window and duplicate the scene 1 comp. Replace this scene 2 comp with our second scene 1 comp. Now open scene 2 composition and change image 1 comp. So, go to project window and duplicate image 1 comp. And replace with this comp layer. Then open image 2 comp player and change the image. Select all keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. You can also change the text of scene 2 layer, so open scene 2 layer, go to project window and duplicate text 1 comp. Then replace this text 2 comp with our text 1 comp. Double click to open text 2 comp and change the text as you like. Perfect. Our animation has done. Hit 0 for ender. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. If you like the video, please share it, like it, and subscribe our channel. For more tutorial, I'll see you in the next video.